We've got Andy Wardall up as the Vixens jammer with zero fox given, still in the penalty box for corruption. And up against Yar, ooh, and there she's out. She's a quick little thing. Looks like Corruption Jammer is coming right after. And she calls it just in time. All right, a lot of heart pushing. All these skaters are pushing really hard. It's jam five. That's normally about the time that the blood pressure decreases a little bit. You can actually focus on what you're doing. And we've got zero Fox given out as lead. And Andy not too far behind. Woo! That was a nice attempt. All right, Zero called it Thank off. Thank you to our IT support who comes to every game and makes sure that all of you watching online can see all of the different views around the entire track. We're very lucky to have him. Andy, Vixen's Jammer, and Cakes is Corruption. Oh, oh, yes. Thought Cakes was going to have it, but Andy is quick, and she was out of there. Cakes is about half a track behind. Oh. All right, we have someone else coming to visit me in the penalty box. Hi, Sosh. Nice to see you. Oh. <laughs> All right, calling the jam. A little bit more of a gap between the two teams, but honestly, that's absolutely nothing and can be taken care of in one jam. Another shout out to one of our sponsors, Tom's Food Center. Tom's Food Center from Portland it's always been their goal to be our community grocery store. They have a whole list of services, including Big B Coffee, pharmacy, and obviously food. So if you're out in the Portland area, make sure you check them out. You got both of these jammers pushing against these walls. Hard fought, it doesn't feel like people are moving much. Oh, nice move, Strega. Mick Jammer is declared lead. Ah, <laughs> she got by you that time. Andy Wardall is, only needs about four inches to get past you. I... So you heard our head ref, you know, I know, you know, I know, you know, that's his name, yell no pack, and that's what he's referring to. A little bit of confusion up here, but bonus, Strega's out of the box. 
We've got beef in the box. And Cakes versus Andy. Cakes is playing with Andy a little bit, playing a little offense of her own. Whoa! Cakes pushing really hard. And Andy is out of the pack, on her way. See what Purple has planned here. Cakes getting through with four points. And Andy's dealing with Strega. It's a good thing our refs are trained in Derby, too. It's a nice knee drop. There's a lot happening out there. Oh, Herterino pushes Slam Cakes out at that last moment. Technically loses her position by then falling. But great job. Being up there, having that edge work to be able to stop Cakes and push her out. See, we've got one green blocker, one purple blocker in the box. So we're 3v3 out there. And it looks like Andy's going to take a moment. got one green blocker in the box. Wow, I just realized. And if I was Tim Agogo, I would have realized much sooner. I don't even know what this means when you have like an even score. They're 97 to 97. All right, slam cakes out as the lead jammer. I feel like I heard an extra whistle. There's, yep, all right. Oh, I'm not going to announce that one. Andy. Andy. Last time I announced something to you guys, then I think the refs heard it, and they did something about it. So we've got Andy in the box, and here comes Slam Cakes. Looks for her third pass, her initial. Oh, we're going to have Swaparoo. Well, it looks like Slam Cakes is going to sit for the entire 30 seconds. Oh, nice catch. Nice catch, Purple. Warhol leading that, that wall. There's a lot of, oh, there we go, making a shape. There was a lot of spread apart derby for a minute there, which is a jammer's dream, especially a jammer like Andy. And there she goes. She's coming around for her first scoring pass. And nice job. Here comes Cakes. Oh. Yep, if you don't hear that, that's Mother Tucker yelling. Thank you, Hudson. I appreciate it. All right, we got beef against Andy Wardall. And Andy Wardall, like I said, you give her four inches, she is through. There goes beef, not far behind.
Interesting to see what's going to happen here. Yep, Andy is going to call it. She doesn't want to let grow, and their capabilities grow is just really awesome. And, you know, looking at that wall, looking at how Lucy has grown, looking at how Kriller Queen has grown. As not, I'm not listing everyone. I'm just looking at who's in my sight. But it's, it's great to see it. Andy's another one. All right, who's going to make it? Andy or Slam Cakes? See, Rogue One right up against Andy Wardle. You got Slam Cakes almost out. Pack reforms a bit in front of her, but she is through. And, oh, almost. Got two purple blockers going out of bounds trying to keep Andy from getting through. That was probably a little over the top, guys. <laughs> Hudson, you're moving when I get home. Neck and neck, what Slam Cake's gonna do. Sometimes she likes to, woo! All right, well. Don't stop that jet. Slam Cakes is lead, and we are eight to eight in this jam now. So what are we gonna do? Oh, valiant attempt. Can dance pulling Cakes back. Cakes calls it, recognizes that Andy has already gotten so we'll start 3v4. Aww. Oh. God, it's like, could I live my life like this? I just say what I want, and poof, it happens. All right, so our schedule. Today's April 15th, right? Tax day, but not really, because they're giving us an extra day or something. Andy's out, great job, kaboom, kaboom in the pack, Slam Cakes is out, Kobe's in the box. May 13th is our next home game, so all of you in the audience should plan on being and here. Those of you online can't see this, but <laughs> thank you, Demo, for cleaning that area of the floor. No, 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 it's totally fine. Don't turn the camera. Okay, sorry, I was a bit confused. External components. So we've got external opponents on May 13th. We've got the LRDA team playing against Dead River and B playing against Glass City Rollers. So be great. We can beat up people that we're not on the same team with. That'll be awesome. See Andy coming in with her, her side surf that she does so well. Slam Cakes is through. Slam Cakes is lead. Seems to be asking her bench what she should do. Purple blocker back out. And Cakes and Andy back through. They're just point for point now. Great job, Andy. Getting through. She's got a leg up on Cakes. And Cakes is through, again, matching point for point. So I'm thinking this jam is going to go the entire way. Got about 25 seconds left. Nice footwork, Cakes. Oh, Cakes calls it. One. And then we've got Vixens with three. So, 161 to 200, five minutes left.
that's a non-issue. It could easily change. All right. Ready, set, riot is lead. Zero. Out quick after her. Closing that gap. Whoop. 